welcome back to the green lockdown and today we're going to be talking about water on this very wet day i like many people used to think that water was a renewable resource that we got through rain cycles like this one but i now understand that that's not the case we've always been running out of water and through modern issues that we've brought about this is just becoming more and more rapid this includes climate change deforestation, pollution, population rises, and our increase in manufacturing. For example, to make one single pair of jeans, we use 1800 gallons of water that we can't get back. It is predicted that by 2025, 50% of the world will be living in water stressed areas. This includes England, where we predict that we will not be able to have enough water to meet the demand of our rising population. So whilst we can do things about these wider issues, which I talk about in different videos throughout the month, today I'm going to talk to you about saving water in general for times of drought and other periods in the future that we might struggle with. Let's get going. A running tap wastes six litres of water for every minute that it's running. How about turning the tap off between brushing your teeth Getting a low flow aerated shower head can reduce your water wastage without reducing pressure. And if you still want to stick with a bath occasionally, then just run the water to an inch shorter than you'd usually do and you could save five litres of water for every inch shorter that that bath is. Make sure that you check your leaky pipes which can double your water bill as well as harm the planet. I think we're good here. The most important ways that I save water is through my water bath. You might look at this and think it's tricky to set up. It's really easy. I did it all on my own. This, just cut out a piece of guttering and put this device in there, which comes in the water bath kit. And then just hook up the tube and put a hole through the butt and you'll start collecting water. I'm even going to put a second one in here because I get so much water from this and it just means that I can do all my watering in the garden in the summer and the dry times with this instead of using the tap. So that's the end of today's video guys. I hope you found that useful and I hope that you'll be able to save some water alongside me to preserve our water for the future. See you tomorrow and please hit subscribe.